Hi, I'm Dr. Leela Avati. I'm professor of dermatology. I practice at MS Diabetes and Shirley Skin Center. So we can do a clinical diagnosis and uh, when, you, when we have doubts we can use a, a special instrument called wood slam. So we, we wood slam wherein we can differentiate between, between whether it is a superficial type of pigmentation or a deeper variety or a mixed variety. And uh, the treatment for this pigmentation is different types of treatments are there. We have chemical peels, we have skin lightening agents. We have lasers, there are also some um, uh, procedures like dermabrasion. Chemical peels, these are basically it's a process wherein we, call, we use uh, certain chemicals called fruit acids which are either alpha hydroxy or beta hydroxy acids and uh, here the, these chemicals exfoliate the skin, that's why it's also called chemo exfoliation. And uh, this melasma, uh, uh, you need uh, multiple sittings uh, to control this pigmentation. And uh, chemical peels are also used for uh, uh, removing fine lines and wrinkles. It's also used apart from uh, uh, pigmentation to also for uh, to lessen the acne scars and also aging. For aging skin, it is used. Then uh, lasers for pigmentation, you have. Uh, different kinds of places different for different indication in uh, uh, pigmentation for we usually use these Q switched uh, NDI glazes. And then um, maintenance is very very important after once you get treatment and uh, the melasma come or the pigmentation comes down it should be maintained because uh, one of the main causes uh, for melasma is again sunlight exposure so this uh, should be prevented you should use broad spectrum um, sunscreens and then you should continuously use uh, skin lightening creams and also avoid certain drugs uh, like as mentioned the oral contraceptive pills can cause this pigmentation so that should be avoided and also cosmetics so cosmetics also uh, contain some tar or some chemicals which can cause melasma so those should be avoided. Now coming to pigmentation. Pigmentation, the common causes for pigmentation is uh, one is oral contraceptive pill intake. Then secondly, lot of sun exposure, ultraviolet people getting exposed to ultraviolet rays continuously. And also pregnancy. Pregnancy is one of the main causes for uh, this melasma. We call this pig facial pigment as melasma. And uh, this usually develops during pregnancy. That's why it's also called as cloyasma. And other even uh, some tar-containing cosmetics also can cause this pigment.